Harrington just trying to get on the ball. Down goes Christian Eriksen. And I have to say, has collapsed in very worrying circumstances. The immediate concern is for Denmark's playmaker in chief. But this is worrisome. I saw the accident uh, happen uh, on the pitch, the throw-in, and uh, the um, reaction from Christian. Christian when he received the ball was very uh, unusual. And I saw the reaction from the players, and I could see that this was uh, different than a normal injury. So we picked up our stuff and ran quickly through the pitch to see. Our first job was to get an overview. What, what was going on and, and Christian was was in cramp so we have to go down and see if we could get a contact I went to the head more than went to the to the body stomach and um, yeah then we did initial examination quite fast and very shortly after he he went out and that's when when I um, turned him around and and, and I, I remember Morton said he don't breathe anymore. And then, uh, then we started. Uh, I started the CPR uh, uh, on him. I always check the knowledge of the sideline teams and the pitch side doctor about emergency treatment. So I decided to give him them a lecture uh, two hours before kickoff in emergency medicine and especially in sudden cardiac arrest. Everyone in the medical team had this video fresh in mind so that they, once they saw the Christian fell to the ground without any contact or anything, they were immediately on track and knew, and knew what to do. This is, was a professional job for us. We did what we should, what we were taught, what we were trained to do. You can see the players, they're trying to form a circle around Christian Eriksen to try and give him some privacy. It's very difficult to say how you how you will react, and but I think as a team we did uh, a maximum effort uh, to to stick together and and, and try to get uh, through that situation and, and be as uh, as helpful as as possible. They did what they could. They helped their friend on the floor with a cardiac arrest. They helped the medic crew. Uh, for giving them some space uh, so uh, we could work in peace actually. Well, I think it was fantastic yeah. they, they did it. Yeah, when you see it afterwards um, I totally agree on that. It's, it was it was a good thing to do. When we knew Christian is was okay, is okay, uh, is, is in a good state of mind uh, as well. Then uh, the most important thing is that we, we kept together and, and, uh, and, uh, and the group stayed uh, strong and united. We now have to experience a very traumatic experience, all of us together, cried together and all these emotions. So, so I think in a way the, the team got stronger uh, after the incident. For me, that he survived is number one, and the second is that we really could show how easy it is that someone can survive if we react fast and if we know what to do. Yeah, and I think the, the good part is that the signal is you just need to do something when, when things happen, just go and do something. such a, a, a dramatic day and fortunately it had a happy ending, an incredible experience for all of those involved. Now one of the recipients of this award can't be with us here this evening, however he did record a short message. Let's hear from Simon Kier. I would like to uh, thank for this award um, on behalf of me but also on behalf of uh, the entire Danish team. Uh, as a captain, I um, feel obligated to, uh, to take this award uh, with my team and only with my team. So, uh, but again, thanks a lot for this award and uh, we appreciate it.
And now please welcome the President's Award winners for 2021, the medical team that saved the life of Denmark player Christian Eriksson at the UEFA Euro 2020. We welcome on stage Danish team doctor Morten Bosens. Next, we welcome the Danish team physio, Morten Skjolje. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank you. A warm welcome to Moens Kreuzfeldt. Next up, we'll have Jens Kleinefeld. Thank you very much. Thank you. Joining us on stage, Valentin Velekov. Next, we welcome Peder Erzgaard. Thank you very much. And we welcome Anders Bosen. And next, Frederick Flenstel. One more applause. One more applause. Thank you very much. These are our President's Award winners for 2021. Congratulations to all of you.